Now, farmers in Dofa, Tagaji, Adidome and nearby communities in the Volta region are pushing for expanded storage facilities and processing plants to reduce post-harvest losses, emphasizing the critical need for such infrastructure to improve crop quality and profitability. They highlight the persistent challenge of inadequate storage facilities, which not only affects their livelihoods, but also impacts the quality of produce available to consumers. City News' Desmond Salasiago provides the remaining details in the following report. Agriculture is central to the Ghanaian economy, yet post-harvest losses continue to plague farmers nationwide, with many livelihoods dependent on agriculture. These losses inflict recurring hardship on farmers each year. Despite bountiful harvest, the absence of sufficient storage facilities and processing plants leaves farmers vulnerable to spoilage and degradation of their produce. In Dofotagaji and Dofo Adidume in the northern district of the Volta region, farmers face various challenges every farming season. Several farmers share their concerns with City News. <laughs> Agriculture Extension Officer John Mensa Money, interviewed by City News, lamented that post harvest losses and other issues leaves farmers with minimal resources to prepare for the next farming season. Most of the challenges, one of the challenges is uh, the rainfall pattern. That the climate change now, the rainfall pattern is not consistent. It has been changing now. It was only yesterday that we have received rain the whole of this year. And also they don't have storage facilities. So by the time they gather their produce from the farm, they don't have any place to store them. So most of them, post-harvest losses is too much. And then uh, diseases on the farm is also another challenge. Uh, for lami worm on maize, uh, fungi, and on uh, pepper production. So a whole lot. By the time they get their produce, they spend a whole lot of so much money on the produce. And also at the storage, they don't have any storage facility. So at the end of the day, the farmer doesn't get enough money, you know, to prepare himself for the next season uh, production. All the governments, when they come, they said. Uh, Agriculture is the backbone of this country, but on, 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 on the ground, it's not showing as such. So my call on the government is that let's, let's do something different. We should have storage facilities at vantage points where farmers can gather their produce, store there when, uh, you know, uh, the time is uh, good for them to sell. They go there, maybe pay something small, uh -huh, and then they get their produce, go and sell when the market is good for them. Former assembly member of the Dofo Adidome electoral area, Prince Zhao, highlighted how the lack of storage facilities forces farmers to sell their produce at low prices, emphasizing the need for government support, especially for farmers near the Volta River. One challenge that our farmers face is lack of tractor facility to plow their farms. Second, after they struggle to plow their farms to the afternoon of getting the seed, Thirdly, after they get some small farm to the next challenge is the disturbance by these cows or cattle. They destroy their farm produce. It's because of that, at the time that 
they have to farmers have to allow their farms produce to grow. They hardly harvest it. They don't have a storage facility, so they sell it at cheaper prices because they cannot keep it. Another thing that's hampering the uh, farming is that there's a lack of irrigation farms. The river, the river after have passed through all the communities, but we don't know why the communities don't have even portable drink water. They have to be struggling with cows and cut uh, other things for the same muddy water. And so if the if the rain is uh, the dressing uh, tennis a little bit, it's, it's a problem for them. For the river water is here, but can never even generate a canal. People have to trek two miles to go and fetch river water water, which is not even treated. What is government doing? Bring canal so that even if you want to take token from the farmers, maybe for the electricity that will generate or pump the water, they should come to an agreement. We have vast land. Go to Holland and see. Go to other countries. Always we are comparing ourselves to this African government. We have the resources here. Just do something. Maybe people who are not able to be precise. At some, some places, they have to work only 30 minutes to go and fetch water. There's no drinking water. No, but the Fadidome is the capital town for the whole of Fadidome, and there's no water. To address these challenges, Agricultural Technology and Marketplace Solutions Company, Complete Pharma, is establishing a new trade center in Tagaji. This center, serving as both a storage facility and processing center, aims to reduce post harvest losses and provide farmers with access to a stable market, as stated by CEO Desmond Coney. The way we've approached farming in Ghana, it's mostly like, um, it's most the opposite way. So f farmers grow anything, and at the end of the cycle, they hope that there is a buyer for them. Now, working with Complete Farmer, what we do is we rather work backwards. We make sure a farmer has a buyer before they even start farming. So in that case, they know what, what specifications the buyer is looking for and how they need to grow their crops to be able to meet the market requirements. This is the very this is very critical for farmers to assess um, key markets. So really, we are inviting farmers to work with us so that we are able to help build their practices so that they are able to grow crops that meet international market requirements and have um, access to markets from premium buyers. The motive behind the whole um, um, Complete Farmer Trade Center is really to get closer to the farmers, um, understand their problems and work with them to find solutions solutions um, together. The farming community said to benefit from the center express hope for increased profitability. Me like like no if you no go maje je ko mi na mi wo do pa ya ma mi ko ebe o ala ko fle na mi a mi o je mi awon ka fe mi a wo do ko Farmers here at Dofo Tagaji and Dofo Azidome all in the northern district of the Volta region are calling for more storage facilities and processing plants to help them in their farming activities. Meanwhile, Complete Farmers is also calling on these farmers to patronize them going forward to help prevent post-harvest losses. Reporting for City News from Dofotagaji in the Northtown district of the Volta region, I'm Desmond Selassiago.